A self-confessed child molester on the run in Macomb County, accused of giving a 13-year-old alcohol, then sexually assaulting her. Tonight, the U.S. Marshals are asking for your help to track him down. 7 Action News reporter Anne-Marie LaFlame has this week's Detroit's Most Wanted. Brent Jeffrey admitted to the horrific crime against a young girl, but when it was time to be sentenced, he was nowhere to be found. The U.S. Marshals say he's still in the Macomb County area and that he has family helping him hide. It, it's my baby. It, it happened to my baby, and I love my, my daughter very much. It's ruined me inside. I, all I think about is this every day. A father's guilt, a daughter's shame. She feels felt betrayed, totally betrayed by this guy, because he's been, like I said, he was a friend of the family for years, and um, he was a friend of my wife's before she died. A 13-year-old girl in Clinton Township mourning the loss of her mother. The young girl should never have even been exposed to alcohol in the first place. The U.S. Marshals say her neighbor and family friend Brent Jeffrey took advantage of her grief, giving her alcohol and sexually assaulting her. Trauma too much for the young girl to bear. Since this happened, she, she's tried to commit suicide. She's, she has anger issues, lots of anger issues. She's upset at the world. Police say Jeffrey confessed and pled guilty to the unthinkable act, then took off. This is almost a year later, and he, he shouldn't be out there. And it, it, I look for him everywhere. The U.S. Marshals are now on the case, and they need your help to find this child sex predator. Uh, the information we have is he's hopping from hotel to hotel, these little, uh, these little rinky-dink hotels. Brent Jeffrey is 34 years old. He's 6 feet tall, 190 pounds. His ties are all in the Macomb County area, Clinton Township, Macomb area. Yeah, the kind of work this guy does with siding and the construction stuff, uh, he could, you know, he could be in anybody's house. He could be doing, I mean, when you get these jobs, you don't ask for a background check on these people. Jeffrey is at the top of the most wanted list as the U.S. Marshals fear there could be more victims. And this father pleads to lock his daughter's abuser up. It'll never be the same. She'll never be the same, but hopefully she can get better. Please just call on this guy. This guy needs to be taken off the street. You know, what if it was your child that this happened to? Now, as always, there's a cash reward for any information leading to the arrest of Brent Jeffrey. You can call the U.S. Marshals anytime at 313-234-5656. I'm Anne-Marie LaFlame, 7 Action News.